What's up people, it's OSS here with iPhone Hacks, and I'm going to be showing you how to minimize and completely disable the system animations on your iPhone or iPad without a jailbreak. So how is that possible? It's a little glitch in the system. So as you notice, if I open any app, let's just open the settings app, you'll see that there's a slight animation when it jumps up. Uh, let's open the tips app. It's like a little, it pops up basically, and then it loads and then you go through throughout your day and you probably don't even notice it but for some people if you're looking for the fastest um, device you're gonna want to disable that so you've all probably heard that if you go to general accessibility and then down here where it says reduce motion you can enable that and that definitely will reduce the motion but it doesn't completely disable it you'll still see that little uh, little slight animation it's not a huge deal but again you'll see that little white screen as it pops up before it loads. So there is a way that you can even minimize that even more. And by doing so, it's a little glitch. You're going to have to go into the settings app. Let's actually disable accessibility so you can see uh, reduce motion so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. But actually, we're going to go into accessibility and we're going to turn on assistive touch right here. And you'll see that, of course, the little white button comes up. Now, with assistive touch, we're going to move it to the bottom right corner, like so. Make sure it's all the way in the corner as far as it can be. This doesn't count. We want it to be right there in the corner. And then we're going to pull up the spotlight, and once the touch, assistive touch jumps above the keyboard, we're going to pull it back down. So I'll show you exactly what I mean. So I'm going to pull down for spotlight. It's above the keyboard. I'm going to pull back up. Boom, up, boom, up. And you're going to repeat this a bunch of times. Um, we say about 20, it all depends on whether you notice um, your device changing. So let's bring it back down, bring it back down. And now if we go into an app, um, you'll see that the animation is gone. You saw that there was no white screen, it just jumped open. Let's try that again. Settings. Let's do another app. Let's do notes. Instantly jumps in there. Uh, clock. Calculator. So again, it just minimizes the the uh, the amount of animation and almost completely disables it. Obviously, there's going to be a little bit, but as you can see, it's definitely much faster um, than previously. Let's try it. Just you know, continue to do it if you think you don't notice the change. You definitely should be able to notice it. Um, and when you do finally figure that out, you can actually turn off the system touch. You don't have to keep it there. So you can just jump back into accessibility and then disable system touch. Um, and your apps will continue to launch super fast um, without that silly animation. Now, if you do restart your device, the animation will come back. It's, it's just a glitch. It doesn't. It's not a permanent thing. So if you don't reboot your device often, this definitely is a super helpful um, little glitch for you to speed up your device whenever opening apps. So again, you go into general accessibility, you turn on assistive touch, you bring down the spotlight after it's in the bottom corner, and you make sure to repeat that process a couple of times. So definitely make sure to check out our full article on iPhoneHacks.com. Um, if you found this video helpful, definitely hit that like button, and also make sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos just like this. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.